Alright, so I'm going to preface this tip by saying that if you have a really high-end computer where you really never need to worry about FPS, or if you have a really low-end computer where pretty much no matter what you do, you're not going to get very good FPS, then this tip probably doesn't apply to you too much. This really applies to computers like mine, which are, you can pretty much go from 20 to maybe 150 FPS, depending on all the various settings you use. So, let me just relog. So, pretty much what, what this tip is, is I have my render distance right now set to normal plus 80 on Optifine. And you can see that I can see till, I guess, that gravel and then the little hill right there. So that's how far I can see. So now I'm going to reduce my render distance and let's see how much that changes. I reduced it to tiny plus 16. And look at this, it didn't actually change at all. So what this means is that the Hunger Games server actually locks in your maximum render distance at tiny plus 16. And no matter how high I increase my render distance, that's not going to change. See, even if I go to far 96, I still can't see any farther than I could see on tiny. So pretty much what you want to do is keep your render distance on tiny plus 16 if you have Optifine, or short if you don't have Optifine, and you will be able to get higher FPS than if you were on a higher render distance. Pretty much this got me to go from like 30 FPS for all recording all the way up to 60 because I was playing on like far render distance thinking that it was helping but really it wasn't.